Hi, my name is John, and in this video I will show you how to set um, CO friendly and lazy load compatible background image. Uh, for this example, I add a section. Okay, this is a section. This is the container. I will add um, heading, basic text, and one boot. Okay, um, remember you can, it's, it's very, very important that you use class in your design and uh, for example fancy bricks and uh, video um, example okay this is the, the main class for this element for the container okay container and for the heading for the text And for the button, okay. And for this example, I will set for the container and min height, okay. And this center, the layout, the padding, okay. This is only for for this example. Now. Um, generally, to set a background, we go to section, the main section, style, and background, and set the background. But for this uh, case, um, I will add an image, okay? This is the image, okay? This is a simple image, um, image that, that you enable lazy loading and you can set the old test okay for example this is the old test and this is a <coughs> image um, for this image we need in the section it's very very important that in the section in the style layout okay you set the position relative now in the image uh, you can set a um, global class for all background image for example fancy bricks and back, uh, image background okay and this is the class for the all background image mm, go to the content very important object cover okay in this case mm. caption no caption style and width 100% hey 100% um this is the, the the position and you can set this you need set a position absolute okay now you can see that the image now is the background but <clears throat> the image is overlaid for the container um for this only in in this setter index uh, you set this this value okay now you can see that the image now is background remember the image um, is in the section uh, okay for this element into this this section um, for the image go to the gradient overlay set the overlay and add one color for example in this case this is black one opacity 0.7 okay save uh, okay this is a book for bricks uh, and reload the page now you can see that the image is a background image and in the select the class gradient overlay change the opacity for example 0 0.6 0 0.5 <clears throat> and the container for example this heading uh, typography white basic text white now you can see much much better and uh, this is the container okay and save and this is the the agreed background image. Okay, reload. 
this is the background image um, you can see that this is only a, a typical image in the section and this is the, the image that works with a lazy load and is friendly with with zero <clears throat> okay and this is other example you can uh, use this class for all background image I will add a new section this is the section container okay uh, okay this is example remember work with class uh, height mean height okay this is the height um, okay uh, we'll add heading and basic text okay and this is only for for this example um, this heading um, okay this is the section remember the section position relative is very very important in the section position relative and in the same section add the image okay this is the image in the section and you can set the image <coughs> example this image okay and add the same class for all background image function bricks image background okay now you can see that this is the image background is very very easy um, you can use the same class for all uh, sections for your web and set the, the background image mm, okay i hope you like this video and um, please subscribe and see you in the next tutorial bye